Hello friends, it's Dave here from Save Decks. And I'm Sophie. And welcome to another review for a Nintendo Switch game. Today we're looking at Let's Get Fit. So what is Let's Get Fit, Sophie? It is exactly what you think it might be. It's a fitness game. Cool, and where did you come to notice this? I actually saw it on the eShop and it was discounted. And I saw that you could get the straps and I think it was for like £5 extra. So I got straps. Yeah, so basically you can get this digital in the eShop for £24.99, but you got it physical. Yeah. It was like £31, £32, something I about think that. So. so basically if you were to get the physical version, you have the straps, which I'm showing footage of now, and you slot the left and right Joy-Cons on, the right one goes on your wrist, and the left one goes on your leg. And basically, the game can monitor you doing the exercises through that. But if you were to buy the digital version, what happens? You can turn that off. Yeah, so basically you can do the exercises. You don't need to have the Joy-Cons active for the game to do the exercises with you. Mm -hmm. But there's a reason why you might want them to, because it keeps a score on how well you do the exercises. Yes. And that's basically a motivation to do them. I'm presuming if you don't have the Joy-Cons activated while doing them it's just the exercises play out and there's no mm. score. So now we've got all the technical details out of the way, what are the exercises like in this game? Um, so you do sets and reps of different types, There's, you know, obviously there's cardio, there's balance, there's strength, but basically you're giving yourself a full body workout. Yeah, there's more than 100 fitness moves um, advertised for this. So you've got three sort of main options when you go in. You've got like, you can do a custom workout. Or a free workout, which yeah. could include one that you custom make. Or one of the set ones that they've got going. Yep, yeah. and then you've got the program. Yes, so that's your challenge. That's like a 30 day program challenge thing that you follow. So I'm doing the summer ready one and Dave's I'm, doing... I'm strengthening my back. Strengthening his back. So like one day it will give you, um, you know, do 10 uh, like push-ups, do 10 like uh, sit-ups, 10 uh, plank up and down plank things and all that. Mm -hmm. And and then it sort of ups it each day, like it's a different workout each day, but it's all based on that thing you're aiming to get. Yeah. And I mean, what I have noticed is that um, it is it stays at the same level until you you keep saying it's either fine or you're not tired at all, and then it makes you onto you know the next level. Yeah, when I was on level two, then it bumped me up to level three. <laughs> I noticed the difference. Yeah. Um, so basically, so for thirty uh, days that you do this game, it will up it like that. Yeah. But then there's the main 30 day challenge is the third option yes. on the menu. So what we've both gone for here is the uh, three minute plank. Indeed. Where it starts you off on about a minute. You have to do a plank for about a minute. Then every day you successfully do that, it will add four seconds to that time. Yeah. Today I did 128 seconds. That's over two minutes. Hooray. And I am noticing a difference with it, and that's the thing I want to point out of this game. Like any sort of fitness, it works. It does. Because on the 60 second plank, I barely made it. and But now, the first 60 seconds of the plank, when I'm doing over two minutes, is easy. And um, I am struggling to get to the actual maximum time each time, but I'm doing it. Nice. And um, how about you? With the plank, I think... I've improved a lot. Like I could only do really like ten seconds at first, and then I suddenly I'm doing like my last one was 114. Oh, sorry, 112 seconds. Yeah, so you're nearly up to the two minutes there. You're nearly up to two um, minutes. I do feel stronger in my stomach. And another thing is because one thing that's really been helping me as well is the fact that um, we're doing it together. Yeah. And I did it on my own today because like. I've been needing you with me when I do the planks because you're telling me how much is left to go because I can't really see the TV yeah. when my head's looking down. And I just need that motivation, like you're encouraging me to keep going. Mm. But today I was on my own when I did it and I managed it. Yeah, yeah. Without, you know, without, um, so I am sort of getting stronger in my mind, I suppose, yeah. doing these. And the same can be said for the programs as well. Yeah, for sure. Um, so obviously if you're playing this digital you don't have the straps you're not using the joy cons 
the game would sort of take your words for it that you did it. Yeah. So it's you yourself have to know that you did it. So there is this whole point of saying like, what is the point in getting this game? Because all the exercises involved, you can do without the technology. Yeah. You can just look on YouTube and find, you know, videos of showing you the exercises. You can do it. But I do find that having it a program there. It sets you, it scores you based on the Joy-Con movements. Yeah. It's a motivation to keep going, especially, and another reason to get the physical over the digital here, not just for the straps, but because we've both got our own switches with yes. our online profiles. We can put the game in both of our switches and compare our scores, scores. with our friends online. Mm -hmm. So there is that as well. Yes, and... Um... There's also like a world leaderboard as well, which is really cool. And I'm like now determined to get to number one. I mean, <laughs> I'm like 343rd on the list. That's not bad. I know it's pretty good, but I'm like, I mean, although the number one, they've got 800,000 points. Really? Yeah, and I'm only on like 73 or something. This game's been out a couple of months now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Um, but still, that person must be a machine. Yes. <laughs> <I> just, <laughs> a total um, machine. So we just gonna, gotta hope that that person gets bored of the game soon. Yeah. And then we can... That's what I'm counting on. <laughs> they get bored and we take over. Okay, so um, we've been talking about this game, just how it operates. Now we go into the part of the review where... We sort of give our opinion on the game, yeah. what we think of it. Um, so I'll go first. Okay. I despise this game. <laughs> At moments, I do too. <laughs> and I, we both give the the middle finger to the screen. <laughs> I've never sworn at a game, and I've beaten Cuphead. I never mentioned it, but I've beaten Cuphead. I've played Cuphead. You have sworn at a game. You've just never put your middle finger up to the screen. That's true. But I've probably sworn at this game more than any other. And that means it's working. Yeah. I am feeling like achy. I am struggling with it. And like I said, for someone who walks 10 miles a day, I am quite unfit. I know. So. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it's hard work. It really is. And we've also um, got a yoga mat, yes, which you, you which already own. I highly recommend because yeah. a lot of floor work. Yeah, according to a lot of TV adverts, everyone's got wooden floors now, no carpet. So, yeah, yeah get a yoga mat or something. But we learnt the hard way. If you own a cat, do not leave the yoga mat out overnight because no. there'll be a lot of holes in that thing. Do you know that night I heard... I heard noises and like when I do hear noises I go psh, 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 to him to you know discourage him sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't and he was just continuing on but I was so tired that I didn't get up and then I realized I came, what had happened. came downstairs found all those holes in that mat yeah still works still works still operates so also on this challenge thing I've noticed that um doing like however many push-ups is one of them as well which yeah. I'd like to try that one next yeah same so yeah, so it, this game does work, but one aspect where it doesn't quite work is in registering the Joy-Cons movements. Yeah. Like sometimes when and we're showing footage of the fitness uh, exercises on screen now, I'll be doing the exercises exact. I, it feels like I'm doing them right. Yeah. It's um, I'm doing them in the same timing as the trainer, but it's saying I did it wrong. Or the red lights coming yes, on. Yes, and that's another thing as well. When you're following the trainer's moves, movements, first of all, he'll stop saying left, right, left, right. Yeah, which but when you're... But then you'll slow down. So when you're trying to follow the rhythm and then he suddenly slows down, mm. that's that's a bit off-putting. It's like it's lagging. Yeah, it's kind of like because um, when you're doing exercises on the floor particularly and you're not looking at the TV screen, you need him to be saying left, right, left, right, because you know when to do it. But he does it for the first three reps, and he just doesn't say it after mm. that. And I'd rather he said it the whole way through so I can count along. I don't need him to, you know, swear like he does. <laughs> he says the old um, H-E double hockey sticks. I think that's where Ring Fit excels in, like, this part. I mean, obviously, because it's, you know, Nintendo, and they put a lot of work into that. But like, there's so much more registering with. And ring it uses fit. the ring, doesn't it? Yeah. But, um, yeah. So yeah, obviously we love Ring Fit as well, and um, this is because um, Ring Fit's very much does the exercise a bit. It's very much a a, a game, really, yeah. isn't it? And it's <laughs> like, more. I mean, it's more to do with like. I mean, you do have leg exercise and stuff, but it's more like resistance rather than like cardio and yeah. stuff. I mean, there is cardio involved, but yeah, it's 
I think I feel like that's where it differs from Ring Fit. This game. Yeah, because this um, Ring Fit, is, um, not Ring Fit. Uh, Let's Get Fit is not a game essentially. No. It's a fitness tool, ba- mm. essentially. So there is no actual gameplay in there. It's not like no we fit that has the balance games and stuff it's just the exercises that's all there are which i go back to that question yes you can just look up these things on youtube and stuff but you don't have the i find it's easier to get motivated when i've got a machine telling me and you and me are encouraging each other motivating each other to do it each night which um we don't always do it each night but we mostly do yeah sometimes it's so late that we you know we obviously we've got to get up for work in the morning that yeah. we leave it but most of the time we try our best to do it and i feel good for doing it as well i do too i feel more, much more energized like i don't feel tired all the time at the moment which is really good and i've done like lots of late shifts and stuff so it's been good for myself really yeah, uh, what do you think of the uh, presentation of this game? I think that is a, actually a really good point because um, there's something we've not mentioned about the game is that when you get good moves, it like bursts the walls and like changes it into a different environment. Yeah. Um, and that I think is like a really nice thing. Like I think it's really cool to have, and it's like motivates you. There's also achievements in this game, so you know, and um, one of them is to get the final evolution on you know the workout room this many times so yeah that's that's a good thing to have i think yeah definitely. the trainers themselves they're, they're pretty cool looking too There's actually four to choose from isn't there yeah yeah jeff we, jeff is we know our one. so well um jeff we hate jeff <laughs> <laughs> because he... i mean i don't hate him but i dislike him you know a lot and then yeah. lucy <laughs> lucy is the plank one She's a plank, is she? She is a plank, but <laughs> she makes us do the plank and we, we flip her off a lot. Yeah, um, <laughs> but I've also learned cause at first we were doing the plank after the main workout, yes. but now I'm doing the plank first, so I've got maximum energy doing Same. it. That could be why I'm finding it easier. Possibly. We do yeah. not know. Maybe I, to next time I'll do that workout first and plank after just to see if there's a difference. Definitely. Um, but also, yeah, when you were talking about... Um, him stop doing the left right left right count and the way he does it slower is because it says try to keep to the rhythm yeah it's hard to keep to the rhythm when you stop counting the rhythm for us it's hard to keep to the rhythm when i'm very sure like yourself that he does it at a different speed he slows down down. yeah and second of all the music that plays is not in sync with the exercise no the music just because i'm doing it to the rhythm of the music and I'm just going completely out of Same. sync with it. So, mm-hmm. yeah, the music, I don't think the music's designed to go with the exercises. So, I mean, most of the time we get like three stars on it. It's not even a problem. Yeah. So, but it is sort of frustrating to see that red symbol appear when yeah. you, you know you're doing it right. But, Sometimes um, I'll be doing the plank and I'll literally be like millimeters from the floor. Mm. Well, that's probably an exaggeration, but I'm very close to the floor and I'm like, there's no way my back is straight, my buttocks are slightly raised, as like they it say. Says, yeah. And there's no way I'm not doing this correctly. The one thing we were talking about earlier, actually, is when you do the set exercises, the program, and it tells you at the beginning, like, here's the exercises you're doing today and how many sets and all that. Yeah. But it would be nice if we could review the, that workout and just alter or just say, a certain exercises that you we don't want to do at all because mm-hmm. for me it's the burpees yeah. where you've got to sort of go down do a push-up then jump up like with your arms in the air I'm go saying. down which i could do that but i can't Not do it the speed he yeah does it. jeff does it so fast jeff is superhuman there's no yes. way people can do it that fast he's, he's like you know captain america or something yeah. like just up down like that and it's like how and do you know the one time i recently because i always sit that one out just so i'll, I'll get the bad score yeah the last time i actually said i'm actually gonna go for it i went, to do it fast. I went down to the push-up and both my knees clicked loudly oh, <laughs> do you remember that yeah i do so yeah i i'm not doing burpees anymore <laughs> i mean like that's an option on when you're doing a custom workout you can say i've got knee pain i've got shoulder pain yeah. i don't see why you can't say actually can i not do this one because it's causing me pain or it's potentially going to cause me pain yeah i like um the brain training game on the ds you did the daily the uh, brain exercise things 
and at the beginning it would say to you, are you able to use the microphone? No, okay, we won't give you any microphone mini games then. Mm -hmm. If there was something like that, like, I can't do these, or, or I suppose the whole thing is, if you can't do this exercise, that's the reason to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, because that's how you learn. I suppose that's probably what they're going for, but it'd be nice. Yeah. <laughs> What do you think of some of the music then? So I know you had something oh, yeah. on so, one of them. <laughs> I started off my, uh, I think it was my plank as well. No, it wasn't my plank, I remember now. It was the um, the main workout, the program. And it was like rock metal music. And I was like, oh my God, like, what have <laughs> I got into? Like, what's going to happen? <laughs> Horrible. Did it motivate you? Um, I don't know. Yes and no. It made my heart go a bit like, oh God got to do this fast so i suppose in a way yes nice <laughs> cool so um that's basically uh, all we've got to say about let's get fit again it's 25 pounds on the e-shop if you want to get it digital but then you won't get the straps if you want to get physical it's a, i think it's worth getting this physical just for the straps yeah yeah because then um, you got you know the wrist one and the leg one it's not like the ones that you can use for um ring fit slash. yeah it's not the same leg strap as ring fit because mm -hmm. Uh, basically it's this one that we noticed this one that the leg strap has to be so the joy cons at the side of your legs at first we were having it at the front mm. and it wasn't registering the leg at all yeah, yeah. and also another nice little detail is um, the trainer on the screen um, he's got a because uh, obviously you're he's basically gonna be your mirror image so if he's raising his left arm you're raising your right arm essentially yeah that messed me out around mm. yeah like I have to like think you know well their, their point of view their point of view so yeah. my right is their left mm. so yeah i was like what <laughs> but what happens on here though uh jeff is wearing a wristband yeah. to represent where your joy con is and on the leg where your joy con straps on there yeah. there's like a colored ring on his shorts to indicate where it is so you know oh it's the one with the joy con on it yeah, yeah. so that's a really good little detail they've done there so would you recommend this game to anyone i would actually i feel so much better for doing you know exercises like that and i feel a lot more awake i don't know i i mean i haven't weighed myself or anything i'm i'm purely keeping it to you know fitness and you know energizing but um i'm sure you know with a good diet and this this is going to be really effective for the summer for the summer prepare for summer what is it called? yeah summer summer ready or whatever summer it is. ready yeah summer um, is coming maybe um, my back is feeling stronger good shout yes <laughs> um so yeah but i would also say um to be wary if you're not someone that usually does exercises and stuff this might you might fall into the trap of like for like the first week like doing it all the time but then because we've been doing it a few times where we'll go Nah, do it tomorrow and then it's like that you and me have been able to motivate each other to not yeah, think like that and i think you it's especially good to have someone to do it with you mm -hmm. so that you can motivate each other to do it as yeah. well because one of us will go oh and then the other one will go come on let's just get it over yeah with. and then <laughs> that's because i would have given up on this long ago if it was just me with this game yeah yeah but um and especially because it's getting harder as well i'm like I need to, yeah. you know, I mean, not harder in but it's giving me harder things to do. But um, I just remember that Bojack Horseman quote. Go on then. Where he says, it gets a little easier every day, but you got to do it every day. That's the hard part. It is. Yes. <laughs> um, so, yeah. So, that's Ring Fit. Well, that's not Ring Fit. That's Let's Get Fit. <laughs> ring Fit's good as well. It is. And it has the ring. It does. <laughs> and you got some resistance in there, so. Yes. That's good. But uh, have no resistance of getting this game, we say. <laughs> <laughs> I tied it back to what we were talking about. Silly. Cool. Anyway, so thank you very much for listening to us. Uh, let us know in the comments down below what you think of this game from what we've told you, if you've tried it or not. Uh, what do you think of other exercise games like Ring Fit or Wii Fit or what else there is? Fitness Boxing. Is that as well? Boxing. I've not played that. I've not played that one. Did we have a demo? Mm, I think there was a demo. I think so, but I think it was the original one because there's Fitness Boxing 2 now. There is, yes. It needed a sequel. It did. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, and sports, I guess. So then, Switch sports. Well, if we're going to follow, there'll be Fitness Boxing 3, 
Fitness Boxing 4, Fitness Boxing 5, then Fitness Boxing Balboa <laughs> to follow the boxing I sequel titles, yes. Nice. Right, anyway, uh, that's, that's going off on a tangent. Goodbye. So, yes. <laughs> Bye, everyone. <laughs>